Hi guys, um, I'm going to show you how to flush your DNS. Okay, so what we're going to do is go down to the start menu here. Now I am on a Windows 7 computer. So I'm going to type in CMD for the command window to come up. And up the top here, there it is. So I need that. Now, if you wanted to run it as an administrator, you just right click on it and say run as administrator. But for this time, we don't really need it. Okay, so I'm here and I want to flush the DNS, but I thought I would just have a quick look and see what's in it. So we're going to go IP config space slash display DNS so what we're going to do is see what it comes up with first now this is the stored information that we have okay so there's a fair bit of it now we want to flush this out now because just say you're on a public computer or you you're trying to get to a website that you usually go to and you can't uh, maybe they've changed their IP address but you've got the host record in here as a different IP address so it happens so what we're gonna do is we're gonna um, go down the bottom okay down to here and we're gonna put IP config space slash and we're going to say flush DNS okay so it's IP config slash or space slash flush DNS I don't know whether you need the space or not it's just a habit for me so you can try it without it won't hurt your computer okay so I just pressed enter and it says successfully flush the DNS resolver cache Alright, so let's have a look and um, see what we've got now. IP config slash and we're going to go display DNS. Okay, so now we don't have anything to display whereas before we had heaps of stuff. So I flushed out the DNS and there we go now there's nothing to display all right um, another thing is that you can um, just go IP oops <laughs> IP config and then slash help and press enter and that will show you some of the options that you can use here see how it's got it there slash display DNS um, slash flush DNS register DNS okay so all you have to do is have a look and read it it just says what it does here all right anyway I hope that helped you flush your DNS okay thanks for watching